This is a uh, quick video from my neighborhood friends who have been talking on Facebook about their uh, uh, fireplace and, and what happens if the power goes out, how can they light their fireplace. Now, some of our fireplaces in our neighborhood have uh, a little black plastic battery holder that holds two D cells. Um, and since we can't get out and drive around at the moment, uh, here's a way to create any kind of battery combination. Um, most batteries are 1.5 volts. If you can see right here, that's what these say. These are just your standard AA batteries. You can do this with AAAs, you can do it with, with Cs, you can do this with Ds. So we're going to make a alternate battery source because I don't have any D batteries. So basically I got two batteries, a roll of duct tape, uh, some wire strippers, and, and two pieces of wire here. So first I'm just going to take a piece of duct tape here and tape the two batteries end to end like so. You get them real close and tight. I'm just going to take them and tape them together. So now I have three volts of potential from this end to this end. Uh, I'm going to take these two wires, just going to strip off the ends of them here. There's one end and the other end. And then this wire, there's one end and the other end. Okay, and now I'm just going to take two more strips of duct tape here. And I'm going to take one of the wires and tape it across the top here of the battery and pulling it real tight and I'm going to take the other one and tape it across the bottom here pull it real tight so it makes a good connection and now I have a 3 volt battery source that I can take these two wires and tape them to the the uh, two metal plates inside the battery compartment for the D size and this will work just as well as the D batteries. It may not have as much as much uh, length as a D battery might have but it will at least get the um, gas valve started on your fireplace.